Alright, welcome back to another GTA 5 online video. I know I always drive my Kuma armor. Why do I even have all these other vehicles, huh? Know what you're thinking. Hey, never know what you may need. Just the force of habit that I have. Uh grabbing the, uh, arm, Kuma armor. Anyways, that's not what I'm talking about. What we're going to do today is a while back, I done in story mode, I'd say it's probably been over a year ago. A house that is up in Vinewood Hills. More or less, the bleeding house when you shoot the window. We're actually going to do more exploring with that um, in GTA Online, see if it's the same. So, if you need me to refresh your memory on that, but it is right here, where I got this little waypoint up in West Vinewood. But, um, you know, the video's way down at the list. So we're gonna see if it's true on, uh, GTA Online as well. You know, do some more exploring with it and stuff. Right up here. And how you could tell the house. Is that? No. Okay. It's right here. I believe. At night, there's usually like a mower and trash can sitting out and stuff. Just look for this address. Well, let me get out here. Right here. 3543. Okay. You know, before we actually get started, we're going to do some exploring. Get somebody out here. Yeah, it looks like a pretty nice house. She's just sitting out there, bathing and stuff. You know, you got this. You know, that would this would probably be a nice house to have in GTA Online to buy. But what we're going to do today is what we came here for. To see if it is actually true. So just shoot this window. And look at there. What is with this house? Yeah, okay, here's an example, okay? You shoot this window. You could shoot any of these windows here. Nothing happens. Okay. Shoot. That window. That window. That one. That one. And she just... She's just chilling in the pool. You know, as I shoot these windows. But nothing happens. Now she's gonna run off. I cannot let her live. Sorry, people. Oh, 
Okay, but anyways, if we get cops, we can get rid of them easily. But... See, I'm just shooting this window. And it's more or less... Blood in the window. Spooky. What we're gonna do is... We're gonna get out the RPG. Wait, didn't I just kill her? I'm gonna run back here and get rid of these cops. I don't know if they're gonna see me in this bush or not, but... Just in case. Uh, but you could see there's something very mysteriously about that house. No other house in GTA does that. You know. And she's back. But... You know, you could spend hours on end just shooting at that window. You know, but that's the address right there. You can still see a blood spot right there. You know, you can shoot any of these windows. And waste all your ammo on this. You know, you can use this weapon if you want. You know, the blood spots get bigger. What causes that, this to be in here, I don't know. And yet, the house of this window is bleeding. Very spookified, if you ask me. Like I said, it is about right here. You know, I may be a little bit off, or so it's just up a little bit further of where I got the, uh, Point of interest. 
Alright, my next thing, being I have time. I thought that was a person there. Wait. Wait. Before, I'm looking this way. And it looks like something was kind of moving. If you saw that, let me know down at the comments section. I'm looking this way. And there was something just going like this. You know, more or less like this towards my car. And it was not my hand. Because my hand was nowhere near it. Alright, so I'm going to call up Pegasus, and I'm going to fly over to my uh, next spot. Hello, this is Pegasus Lifestyle Management. How can I help? Thank you, Matt. Well, I chose the buzzer. Your spectacular habit. aircraft is now ready for you at our nearest airfield. And also, last night after I got done with uh, my YouTube video, if you look there, all my stats are maxed out except for mental state. You want to ma max your mental state out? Be my guest. But it just makes you a bad sport. Just letting you know that now. Yes, they say that if you uh, get the dunce cap on your head and you uh, get that cap, you can save it into your inventory thing. You know, because it's a rare hat. I really don't want to find out myself. You know, become a bad sport. Yes, I do kill somebody occasionally. But... I'm not into going and killing people. Unless it's by accident. Or in a mission. That trash talk talk, that's another easy mission you could do on your own. Alright, we are going to, f you know what? Let me land this right there for now. <clears throat> We're gonna go. Right here to the Yellow Jack Inn. In my budget. You know, it's a fast vehicle. I use it practically in all missions, including trash talk. Anyways. A while back, I also... In another video, <clears throat> we talked about... Nico Bellic. And that, uh, if you're not familiar with Nico Belli, he was in, uh, GTA 4, and he talked about a, you know, he was gonna, uh, buy this bar, you know, out in the desert area and all that. And there's reasons to believe that supposedly that he was supposed to be in GTA 5. And a lot of people think that Trevor took him out. So I checked that out in story mode. Today. We're going to find out if that is the case in GTA Online. You know, see if we can get the same artif uh, artifacts or the same 
Um, you know, uh, get into the uh, yellow jack you know I've been working on my uh, my landing as well to, you know so you're not getting that rough landing see how much better that was let the helicopter do the work you know let the plane do the work all right so we're gonna enter the yellow jack Okay, here you can still see Nico Belly's coat. You know, there's the barmaid still in there. And you still see a blood spot right there. I didn't mean to point the gun at them. You know, you still see a blood spot there. Blood spots there. You know, there. Okay. So here, here's my theory, okay? Nico Bellink was sitting right there where that barmaid is. Okay. He goes and he runs and tries to grab one of these knives here. But he couldn't. So he runs back here. You can see more blood spots right here on the floor. You know, like he was bleeding. He tries to get out this door here. Okay. Runs around this. You know, runs around this pool table. And he gets taken out right there. You know, and then you can also see it. You know, which looks more like more blood stains right here, and then also a picture. around the city you might want to use. Give me I a call and I'll send you the location. Um, you know, more or less people say that that is Nico Bellic driving that tow truck. You know, here's some more uh, interesting pictures. You know, some more numbers you could definitely call if you would like to. You know, there's some uh, interesting things back here as well. You know, I just like doing exploring. But, uh, you know, it looks like maybe someone got into a fight there. And then this, right here, that's in reference of GTA Vice City. You know, it's on all these bills all around here. That kind of reminds me of, uh, Jimmy, it looks like. beer anyone <laughs> yeah, after all we are in a bar It'd be pretty cool you actually come in here and you know just walk up 
sit down at this counter and have a beer. You know, preferably without your gun. But, that is pretty incredible that they put that in GTA Online. You know, they got some type of trailer back here as well. You know, maybe Nico Belli lived in that. You know, before he got a house, which is up here somewhere. You know, I'm not too sure where. Um, you know, since I'm here, I'm going to go ahead and take care of this gang attack. And also, sometimes you could put some weapons, uh, pick up weapons on here as well. I just usually shoot my gun, letting them know, hey, I'm here. But, uh, anyway, Pretty incredible that there's things in that are in story mode that they incorporated in online as well. You know. But, uh... You know... The things that they put in online... Is absolutely... You know, in story mode... When they put it in online... Is... Absolutely... Incredibly... You know, I would advise not picking up the money until all the uh, gains are down. Boom shakalaka. 15 kills, 6 headshots, 500 RP. Now, pick up the money, guns, you know, what would be incredible is actually could pick up all the guns that are laying around. And I had nothing on me. See, I just picked up the same gun that I had. And look how much money I've picked up so far. And there's still money laying around. One, one, one. Could pick up like over a thousand to two thousand dollars. Just by picking up this money. Eleven fifty. Eleven seventy three. Eleven seventy three, Bob. What? Uh, that was spooky. I go over this gun and it just goes off by itself. 
Okay. So that tells me that this place is haunted, perhaps. I'm gonna go back to my chopper. Get to the chopper. Anyways. If you enjoyed tonight's video of the mysteriously, bleeding house, then let me know if you enjoyed it by smashing that thumbs up button, plus seeing if the Decabellic Easter Egg is still in the GTA Online. It's Infinite Rage! There's an Infinite Rage uh, thing there. Anyways, if you would like to see any more in GTA Online, let me know your thoughts. We're gonna fly over this prison and see what happens. You know, a lot of people say, don't fly over the prison. You know, flying over the prison, do they not care? There we go. Anyways, instant four star wanted level people. Which I can easily lose because I'm not good. If my helicopter wants to stay working. If Pegasus does not decide to take it back. Which, just in case, I'm going to make my way to the airport. Anyways. If you would like to see me do anything on GTA Online, let me know down in the comments section below, and I lost the one in level. Pegasus is about ready to take this helicopter. Oh, it's on fire! Ah, run! Run! I made it to where I wanted to go. Uh, feel free to let me know down in the comments section on what you would like to see. You know, it can be anything, you know. And I am going to be working on getting the, uh, the heist, Pacific Standard Job, to see if you can actually drive the Kuma armored car instead of those bikes. I'm gonna do it first, and if so, then I'll do it again on the, uh, for you to see. You know, I just want to try it first. Because I've never seen anybody do it yet. And then if so. Then. I will. Um, put it in a video. Seeing if there's something here that I can fly back to town. Yes, there is a helicopter. 
so nothing in the hangar. This will do. So, I will see you in another GTA 5 online video. So long, everybody.